a huge legal win for many with the Shreveport Police Department. We've learned they won a court ruling over hazard pay compensation money. They say they should have been paid for a handful of months during the COVID pandemic. Attorney Pamela Breedlove filed the suit on behalf of officers employed at the time for unpaid wages and other compensation money. She says they're entitled to under the department's own policies. KSLA News 12's Angelia Allen breaks down the lawsuit. The city of Shreveport is still dealing with the pandemic and its fallout. Officers here might be entitled to additional pay and time off through this lawsuit. Police officers are required to work. I mean, that's, you know, the city still needs protecting. And the members of the Shreveport Police Department were willing to do their job, but what they wanted was for the city of Shreveport to honor its obligations contained in their general orders. Pamela Breedlove, on behalf of the officers, took on the suit against the city and won. Now in a seven page document she had shared with KSLA, we are seeing the basis for the lawsuit against the city of Shreveport. Police Officers Association President Dr. Michael Carter says this ruling and the judge's sentiments noted in the document were unprecedented, saying that to deny the dedicated police officers the compensation they have rightfully earned is unconscionable and unequitable. When when my members individually started actually reading the, con the, uh, the context, the, the actual text written by the judge, uh, they were deeply humbled. Uh, I have seen grown men and women uh, who have responded to some of the worst situations you could ever imagine stand and read these words in the past uh, two days. And uh, it's silence. SPD 301.02 provides that when City Hall is closed because of emergencies, it says, talks about inclement weather or other emergencies mm -hmm. declared by the mayor. Mm -hmm. It's undisputed that the mayor declared an emergency going on during this time period. The problem identified in this lawsuit is that those working from home were compensated similar to those risking their safety and health in person. Now, a Caddo Parish Court has ruled in favor of those officers who served in person. How to protect themselves in a fight, in a shootout, all those kind of things the officers are trained for. An invisible disease that you don't know whether somebody has that can kill you, they weren't trained for that. This ruling means officers have three possible outcomes. Monetary compensation paid to officers who worked in person, the time off given for hours worked up to 240 hours are both time off up to 240 hours and monetary compensation. Breed Love says, while this is a win, officers might not see the reward anytime soon. Attorney Breed Love tells us that opposing counsel has already decided to appeal. More developments come along. We'll keep you posted. Angelia Allen, KSLA News 12. And a short time ago, uh, Carter sent us a statement late this afternoon about that ruling. It reads, the Shreveport Police Officers Association would like to extend our appreciation to the court and reference to the ruling. During the worst pandemic of our modern times, members of the Shreveport Police Department served the citizens of Shreveport without hesitation. We responded to calls for service when the average American was not required to attend work or school.